Good morning. So today we're going to talk about some of the features located on the web page to be allow you to do your Pacific Pride Smart Lock upgrade. So what we're going to do is we're going to take you to opwglobal.com. There will be a GUI to take you to the Pacific Pride information. So this GUI will take you directly to a web page that will be exclusive for Pacific Pride upgrades. The information contained in this page are setup checklists, other documents that are going to be required. You've got quick links that will take you to the site surveys, the Echostat application, uh, upgrade checklists, the releases that have been done, and other miscellaneous information also have a page that gives you the contact information for everybody that needs to be contacted. The next portion that we're going to go through will show you how to do the artware setup for a Pacific Pride upgrade. Today we're going to discuss the use of artware for the Pacific Pride upgrades. One of the first things that's going to be done when you open your artware is you're going to validate that you've got artware 3.7. 3.7 is going to be required to be able to do your artware upgrades. Go to the help file, bring up help about artware, and then verify that you're on version 3.7 at a minimum. Once you've verified that, you're going to go back into file, you're going to open the database, and you're going to see that we've got Pacific Pride SLR. That's the database you're going to want to use. This gives you the preset for 15 sites. If you have more than 15 sites, you're going to copy this file, save it into your database as, a, as an SLR2 or any number that you want to set for that. Once you've got that set, you're going to open a site. The main difference between what we're doing here and what we've done with previous versions of Artware is that your network functions are already preset for you. The rest of your site setup will be basically the same as you've done in any other artware versions. You've got your site information. This would be for each one of your Pack Pride sites. You've got your pump controller information, which is the same as you set up for any other site. Your pump information, which you're setting up the same as you would for any other site. And your terminals, depending on the type of terminal. These are preloaded with COPTs. Typically, that's mostly what's on Pack Pride sites. You can change it to a hybrid or a FIT 500. And then your networks, which is, is already set for you. There's nothing to do other than to set in your Pack Pride information. It's very important that you follow all of the installation manual line by line for what's happening. Artware is valid and it is going to be an integral part of whatever you're doing to upgrade your Pacific, side, Pacific Pride sites. Once again, just follow your database, open your database, choose the Pacific Pride SLR. The Pacific Pride single MDB is not going to be used for the upgrades. It's the Pacific Pride Smart Lock replacement that will be used for that. And if you have any questions, then you can contact Tech Support. Thank you.